Hi there, it's Bethany with Fidelis Property Group, a veteran-owned real estate team serving families near the Pentagon and Fort Belvoir. Do you have PCS orders to the Pentagon? Here are three things that you need to know about moving to this area. Be sure to watch all the way to the end to hear about a free resource that we've got just for military families moving to the Pentagon. The first thing you need to know, and you've probably heard this already, is that the traffic here is a little crazy. Okay, let's be honest, it's full out nuts. Traffic jams, construction. So you're gonna find, wanna find ways to minimize your commute to your duty station or at least make it less stressful. When it comes to commuting to the Pentagon, there are several options to get there. Driving, taking the Metro or the VRE, or taking the bus. If you're driving, our best advice is to live as close as you can to the office while still getting enough space that you need for your family. In the DC area, the closer you get to the city, the less space you're gonna get for the price of the home. But if it means your active duty member is going to get to spend more time at home instead of in traffic, it's well worth it. If you're taking the Metro, there are a lot of great neighborhoods to choose from in Alexandria and Arlington, as well as DC, of course. You're going to get the most space for your money in Alexandria. So consider areas near the Van Dorn and Huntington Metro stations. There's also the VRE, which has nearby stops in Burke and takes you up to the King Street Metro, where you can take that train right there to the Pentagon. Finally, don't forget the bus lines that go direct to the Pentagon the Fairfax County Connector and the WMATA bus, sometimes called the WMATA bus, have multiple stops in Springfield, Burke, and Alexandria, and OmniRide even has bus lines from Dale City and Woodbridge where you can get even more space for your money. There are a ton of options to make your commute easy. The second thing you need to know is that the region around the Pentagon and Fort Belvoir is a seller's and landlord's market. Most homes here sit on the market for two weeks or less and they sell for an average of 99.5% of list price. Good rentals typically go quickly too, and many of them are rented through word of mouth instead of going on the open market. The good news is that if you're planning to buy, it's very easy to rent out that home during your next PCS cycle, so that you can either hold it as an investment or come back to it during a future tour here. If you're buying, be sure to have all your ducks in a row before you get here. So have a pre-approval letter from a local lender who understands this market and have a great realtor lined up to make appointments for the places that you like. If you're renting, ask your friends or get on the local Facebook groups here to see if anyone is renting out their place soon in the neighborhoods you want to be in. Military by Owner is also a fantastic place to find good rentals. Most of our military clients use this to list their homes for rent. And in either case, ask your realtor if they're willing to do video tours for you. That way, if you don't find a place during your house hunting leave, you still have some boots on the ground that can see the place on your behalf and give you virtual details on the home condition. The third thing you should know is that there is so much fun to be had here. The amazing museums and history of Washington, D.C. are just the beginning. The D.C. Maryland region is filled with fun things to do for adults and families, local events and festivals. It's also super convenient to enjoy other great amenities on the eastern seaboard. You can take a Bolt bus or the Amtrak up to New York City for the weekend, or take a short drive over to Liberty Mountain or Wintergreen for a weekend ski trip. There are beautiful wineries and fun breweries just down the road, like Potomac Point Winery in Stafford, Paradise Springs Winery in Clifton, and Port City Brewery in Alexandria. If you have kids, you'll never run out of options. The local rec centers have weekly classes and camps, the schools are highly rated, and there's an activity program for everyone. You're going to love living here and getting the most out of our nation's capital. Below, I'll link to a special guide that talks about the 10 best neighborhoods to live near the Pentagon. So go check that out if you're trying to find the right neighborhood for you. If you have questions about living here or are looking to buy a home before you PCS, reach out to me directly. My team would love to help make your PCS an easy one. For more tips just like this on moving to the Pentagon or Fort Belvoir and the surrounding areas, please subscribe to this channel. We release new videos every Tuesday. Do you have orders to the PCS? Here are three things you know.